All right. It is my pleasure to be joined by former 12-year quarterback in the NFL, none other than Kellen Clements. Kellen, how are you doing today? I'm doing good. I appreciate you having me on this morning. Well, thank you so much for taking the time. I, I, I mean, you know, it's not every day you get to talk to the person that was sort of mentoring this kid, Justin Herbert, who's just lighting the world on fire as a rookie quarterback. I, I mean, I'm sure you saw this coming in a sense, but how surprised have you been just with how he's been able to really come in with, with a very minor hiccups for, for someone that's seen their first action in the NFL? You know, especially when you think about how – his first real action came to, you know, came to be with Tyrod's unfortunate injury. Justin had no preseason. Obviously, he had no spring ball. Um, so really a challenging situation for him um, to come into. Um, but I've been really excited for him, how he's handled it. He's obviously played really well. Um, you know, some, some minor growing pains, um, as we all experience. But um, – his ability to come in, distribute the football, doesn't look like he's making a lot of um, judgment errors, if you will, especially getting in and out of plays. I mean, Shane's got him, offensive coordinator Shane Steichen has him checking plays um, just like you would expect a veteran to be doing. Um, and, uh, yeah, very excited for him. I, I can't take any credit this is a, it's in that mentor role, um, but uh, he's, a, he's a good good person um and obviously a good player so i'm just excited for him and his success and how much of that getting success early has to mm -hmm. do with the coaching in this scenario because uh i believe also it's um his quarterback coach um i can't believe i'm blanking pep on hamilton. pep hamilton yeah. I, I mean just talk about being in a situation where not that it's you, you can't lose but certainly set up for some success considering the weapons in the team in la as well yeah he, he um you know, it hurt, it hurt Justin because, you know, they lost Pouncey at center early um, and having that veteran presence, especially in, you know, from a protection standpoint, Mike declaration and changing things, depending on where the pressure is coming from, um, at, put a little bit more on his plate. But, uh, you know, the guy graduated with like 4.2 or something. So, you know, intellectually it was not going to be a overload for him. Um, but I think that, you know, uh, there is a significant amount of credit that certainly goes to Pep, who, you know, kind of obviously had a bit of a track record for what he was able to do with Andrew Luck his rookie year in Indianapolis. Um, but then also to Shane Steichen, who's putting Justin in a position um, to be successful. And, you know, there's – look, he's, he's not opening the whole thing up. It's not – he's not calling plays or going in um, – with a, a catalog, if you will, like he would have a year ago with Phillip and a guy who's been there and played for that long. Um, but Shane has done a really good job. And I, I, was a, I was with Shane when I was there. I think the world of him as an offensive mind, as an offensive coach. Um, but he's done a really good job of putting Justin in position to be successful. And then to Justin's credit, he's capitalized on the opportunity. Right. He certainly has. I, I don't think yeah. anyone expected, no defense expected him to be able to throw the ball as far down the field as he's shown that he can. So I, I think he caught a couple of people by surprise. Yeah, he really has. And, and doing it really with his feet out of position. Um, there's been several throws where the ball has gone a very long way downfield and he hasn't been able to step into it. Um, that was one of the things that really impressed me in seeing it now at this level is his ability to move and slide. I mean, he's obviously a big kid, but move and slide in the pocket and then still deliver accurately way downfield um, is something that's, that's – you can't teach that. Uh, that's, just a, that's just a gift, and he's a big, strong kid that's able to utilize it. 